a, a, uh, you know, Mr. Chuck, you have interrupted me on a very important work day. Listen, if I'm gonna work for you, you're gonna have to work for me. I need the pro tips, okay? I'm tired of this. Listen, all the little know-it-all trolls never even lived out there being all like, oh, I'm gonna analyze this, analyze this. Oh, look at the background. It's all like little warpy warp. It's fake. Well, what I'm asking you is, I need a better tutorial from you because the last one you gave me obviously is unsatisfactory. <laughs> ah, that's embarrassing. Okay, Mr. Serious. This is it? Everything you need to learn is in there. Yeah, whatever. So this is gonna take away all the little warps in the background? It's basic stuff. You should have known it already if you weren't an imbecile. <laughs> yeah, right. All right, how much do I owe ya? We don't need your money. Good, cause I ain't bring nothing. People may not like to admit it, Mr. Chuck, but they need you. Oh, man, Mr. Serious, oh. Listen, Chuck. You could be good if you wanted to, but, but nothing. You know what, I hope you have a good rest of the day with your little philosophical poems you're writing down. <laughs> but you gotta focus. Right now, the internet is cracking down on you. You made the mistake of warping objects in the background. You get called out for Adobe Gains. You can't be that guy. You gotta level up. So you need this Photoshop tutorial. So being evil, just like Chuck, you wanna open up Photoshop. Take your image. Now instead of just using the smudge or bloat tool, like a lot of people do, who are amateurs, what you wanna do is you wanna use the lasso tool or the magnetic lasso tool. Grab around or select around the part of the body that you wanna enhance or make bigger. So you select the layer. Now this is where the trick comes in. After you select the whole thing, you make a full loop around the object that you want to enhance. You right click and then you go layer via copy. This takes that selection and makes a new copy out of it and puts it in a new layer. So now you can smudge this layer. You can bloat this layer. You can do anything you want to this layer and it won't affect the rest of your photo and it won't smudge anything outside of the borders because it's a brand new layer on top of the whole entire picture. So now a lot of people will start smudging things. This is a little fishy because it just, you can tell that the object's blurry in certain areas. So if you want to do something simple like make a body part bigger, more enhanced, I would recommend using the free transform tool at first. This will uniformly expand all the pixels in the selection at a uniform rate. So everything uniformly blurs and you don't get any weird smudgy, blurry smudges that are a dead giveaway. So after expansion, you might have some leftovers. Instead of trying to erase those outliers, those leftovers, those sharp angles that may be popping off the body part, you wanna go back to the transform menu, but this time go to warp. Now, a grid pops up and you can warp certain things around, around the outside of the layer you've enhanced, warping it back to the surface, to the surface of the original picture so it flows smoothly through the entire deception. When a new firewall comes out, new viruses come out, so new firewalls have to come out. The thing is, is just when you think you're safe and you figured out the method for calling out people who are faking things, the fakers, the deceptors, come up with new methods to stay on top of the game. Try to develop your own opinion based on your actual own opinions. Gather the facts, gather the information, and see what you can put together. Thanks for watching, thanks for supporting. I hope you guys like this video. I hope it's entertaining. Don't freak out, you know what I mean? It's just for fun, but also I hope it sends a good message. If you're enjoying fitness industry, check out the full series. And don't forget to subscribe. And comment and like and share because I got daily uploads coming out Monday through Friday, okay? Every day of the week. You all have a good one and I'll see you in the next video.